This is the 1979 Isle of Man silver proof one pound coin. Let's take a look. Okay, so coming in with an Isle of Man coin, this is one which uh, again has come out of the um, the basement trunk or what or one of the boxes from my grandfather's collection, which is rather large, um, which I have um, luckily managed to um, you know become the person who who, who got it. So. Um, yeah, this is a um, Popjoy Mint coin. It is a one pound coin and it is part of the official legal tender issued by the Isle of Man government. And it's a limited silver proof edition. Uh, it's in solid stone and silver and they only made 75,000 of it. So it's cool. So it's got the, um, basically it's um, on the obverse, it's got um, the right facing bust of Elizabeth II wearing uh, um, basically the um, girl, quote unquote girls of Great Britain and Ireland tiara and it's got the uh, legend and date around the bottom so it's 1979 at the bottom there sorry I'm just giving you a full reflecto vision there so you can't see anything 1979 Elizabeth II and she's wearing that that very famous tiara um, so yeah that's really cool and um, yeah on this side um, we have um, the um, Triskelis on um, on top of uh, the map, which is the the Triskelis are the um, are the legs basically, and um, yeah, it's got the Isle of Man at the top and one pound on the bottom, and you've got the um, fleur de lis uh, around uh, the top and the left and the right side as well. as a little uh, another Triskelis kind of circle there, which I believe um, is some sort of mint mark. Um, that I haven't actually seen on another version that I found online, but it must mean something. But anyway, it comes with a nice little proof, uh, certificate that, that says um, this here says certified this proof minted one pound coin contained in this case part of official legal tender issued by our man government. It's strictly an edition uh, as here under solid sterling silver proof seventy five thousand only, and then the Isle of Man treasury with uh, the Pop Joy mint. Pop Joy mint's not around anymore either. It was it, it was a great a great little. Uh, Great little um, mint that did collected collected items and stuff like that. They were around for quite a while. And actually, um, one thing which I just I found literally as I was getting this out was my grandfather, because we've got we've got we've got family friends in Isle of in the Isle of Man. Basically, he has put a actual Isle of Man one pound coin in there as well. I don't think that's a silver one; it's a standard one. So there's a standard one next to it, for example. And the size looks this 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 sterling silver one looks like it's a little bit bigger. But that could be a optical illusion. It does. It looks like it's the milled edges are obviously well. Obviously, it's more profound than the other one. But yeah, this is just a sta the standard one. And it's a, obviously not in its great condition, but it does have that mint mark on it as well. So anyway, uh, that must mean that it's um, legit. So anyway, yeah, this is a really cool coin. I like it. Um, I'm going to start getting into some Isle of Man coins. So I've just found a little trove of Isle of Man coins, and I think, well, if I've got them, might as well put them on the channel. So. You know, Isle of Man is a small little island uh, that is a um, crown depend. It's an independent. Um, I need to get this right, or I'm going to offend a lot of people. So, uh, basically, the Isle of Man, as far as I'm aware, is um, an independent um, crown state that is basically it's a, it's a crown dependent state. So, as far as I say, it's like it's all kind of like Guernsey and all the other ones. So, they are part of the United Kingdom, but they're not. Um, correct me if I'm wrong on that one. My, uh, you know, I've been to Isle of Man a couple of times, but I have never actually bothered to check its political situation, which is which is a bit, um, which is a kind of a bit embarrassing for me because I do actually know the um, the house, the keeper of the House of Keys there, which is like their Parliament. I actually know him quite well, and he's like basically their Prime Minister. So, um, I, I, I Ju, and if you are watching this, I'm sorry, but um, I should know more about the Isle of Man. But anyway, I'll get myself educated up on that, and the next Isle of Man coin, I will give a full history of the Isle of Man and how great it is. Um, but yeah, anyway, this is a great one pound coin. And uh, if you haven't got one, why not get one? Because I've looked online and you can get them. Although this is a, going for about, they're going for about £60 online at the moment. I checked on New Mister and yeah, it's about averaging about £60 for this. So not bad little return for that uh, one pound coin's worth of silver. 